peeps welcome back to my channel i'm here about to do a very this little video is just a very quick get ready with me just extremely quick and we're starting with primer as always which is my catrice when i'm trying to use this up it's nearly gone not a whole lot left in her at the moment let's hope now that this goes well for me i wouldn't be the quickest makeup artist going but this is literally just to bring the dog out for a walk so that and grab my first decaf coffee since i had my mini gastric bypass which by the way is what i had a mini gastric bypass instead of the sleeve because of the um i have severe reflux so the surgeon in his wisdom we had a good discussion and um, it was decided that the sleeve might not be the best option for me as it tends to make that condition worse. We've got a little bit of Garnier BB cream and light, a little tiny bit of By Terry CC cream just to give it a little bit of a jazz. Not a whole lot, just a pump, half a pump. Okay, and we're using our number seven brush from It Cosmetics, blending it on the back of the hand, popping it onto the cheeks. Blending it down around the lower part of my face. I have a little bit of rosacea. My operation went extremely well, lads, I have to say. I will, there are a couple of teething problems, um, but nothing that the universe can't, uh, nothing that won't be resolved in time. Okay, so we are just brushing our little tiny bit of BB cream around our face. Tiny little bit of colour. Even at skin tone, I'm not really doing much of it makeup wise today. Not the humour, guys. Um, let's have a look for a little bit of concealer. We're still using our the last of our eraser from Maybelline. So if it, I, I don't believe in uh, wasting makeup. I use it till it's absolutely bone dry. Back all in it. Bugger all in it. Yeah, back on. I'm going to blend that in with the number seven from my cosmetics up onto the nose, side of the nose, leave the under eye for just a second, then tap. And hope for the best, my friends. I haven't been to my local coffee shop down the town, down Granuel since my surgery, but the girls are all saying that decaf coffee is a good thing. I might help with the other issue I'm having. An issue they don't tell you about after gastric, mini gastric bypass, gastric bypass. You just, um, or any sort of um, bariatric surgery, I might say, as a bariatric patient. Um, toileting can be a bit of a bitch, if you know what I mean. Just takes a while for all your insights to adjust to the changes that have been made. You know, because the surgeon, it is major surgery on the inside. Now on the outside, I only have five little little incisions, but on the inside, I'm sure there's a fucking hell of a lot more incisions than that. <laughs> Given my stomach is this size. And you should see my dinner. It's a shocking shit show, guys. It's a shocking shit show. <laughs> We're still rolling here. This camera keeps cutting off every so often. But that's okay. The iPhone 11 not the best phone in the universe but you know what it suits me yeah. powder is on and i've used the elf powder it's their setting powder i love it next we have a little bit of bronzer i'm going to use this guy up he's been on the go for years i've hit pan on him bobby brown golden light he's been on the go for a very long time so we're around my mac 109 Just give my cheeks a little bit of a jizz. I'm not going all like contour or like all that shit today, lads. I just don't feel like it. But I knew I couldn't go out like a cream cracker. Otherwise known as an acker. Okay. Get the three chins, baby. Get the three chins. I have been doing a small amount of retail therapy. Believe it or not. Vintage shops. I got two tops in the vintage shop. 
which will fit me in the very very near future. Last week, first week post bariatric surgery, Mandy lost ten pound total because of the whole toileting situation. There's a very good chance that there'll be bugger all off me this week. I'd cry because I really haven't. Because I'm on 400 calories a day. How can you not lose weight on 400 calories a day? That's all I'm on. 400. 600 is, is the maximum I'm allowed. 600 calories. Holy shit. It's less than a five month old will be on. Blush. Life's a peach. Very old. Tiny bit of colour. And I will blend all this in because it's, the edges are a little bit rough. It's a little bit rough. I'm, I'm not too fussy today, to be honest with you guys. I just wanted you to, just wanted to talk to you, basically. So, do I recommend bariatric surgery? That's the question a lot of people are going to ask me. It depends what you hope. You have to have realistic um, expectations. Right. Um, with the sleeve, you use 65%. Of your excess weight so if you're 100 pounds overweight the most you'll use for example is 65. with the mini gastric bypass and the bypass you're looking at 80 percent so i have 100 pounds to lose i might get lucky and lose 80 of them might get lucky not everybody does some people lose the weight only to regain it it's it's not an easy fix you have to keep working on it if you want to be healthy for life. To that end, I have bought a book called, or didn't buy a book, sent a book. I was sent a book called The Pound of Cure. <laughs> buy a book, Jesus Christ, you won't catch me fucking buying a book. The only book I will ever buy is, the, is um, anything to do with menopause. Okay, now I apologize I was looking away because I was trying to blend all this shit in together. That's my makeup for today, now except for my brows, which I'm going to use a little bit of e.l.f. Taupe. It's their um, brow, blah, 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 with slight colour to it. Now, my munchkin is so patient here beside me. She came home yesterday, I was delighted to see her. Delighted to have her back in my, in my bed last night, missed her. You don't realise how much you miss your babies till they're home. You know, even the little furry ones, even the little furry ones, guys, you just miss them. I missed her terrible. Didn't realise just what an important part of my life that dog is. Now I'm going to chance a bit of liquid out on her eyes. I mean, I'm literally going to chance it. There's no guarantee. Not too bad. This is my bad eye, guys. You know how you have a bad eye? And nothing goes right on it. It always looks like a piece of shit. Now, that's my eyeliner done. I am not bothered with mascara because the MAC mascara I got, the sample I got, the free sample I have, is an absolute garbage can. Lips um, is by Huda Beauty. And I haven't got my glasses on, so I'm gonna have to put them on on to read what it is. Pinky brown. God, my eyes are, my eyes are fucking uneven. Fucking hate that, lads. Really do. Go over it with a bit of gel eyeliner. I just. This is why I don't wear liquid eyeliner. 
because I can't get it even. I do the best I can, but for some reason, I have to blend it in and blend it out all sorts of ways to try and get it to look half decent. Right, that's it. It's not perfect, but as they say, it will beckon do, lads. Okay, we'll twist this up. This is a twisty. Get a whole lot on this. I'll be giving out to Huda. What people don't realise about bariatric surgery, lads, right? The weight comes off fairly quickly. because it resets all our hormones. And the so doing resets what's known as your set point. My set point was very high. What the operation does for you, and it ask any bariatric surgeon, is it will lower your set point. So say I'm 250 pounds and I should weigh 120. Well, if I'm lucky, the hormone change will reduce my set point maybe by 100 pounds. I am not 250 pounds or anywhere near it. But I will confess I wasn't far off at one stage. Uh, L'Oreal liquid lipstick in, what colour is this? I am power. Love it, stays all day, doesn't budge. Okay, I got my colour done there last week, so, and it seems to have uh, my, uh, just before I went to Turkey for my surgery. And that's my hair, colour, my roots are done. That's my makeup, guys, up close. Thanks for watching. See you all in my next video next week. Take care, God bless. Any questions? Below, please. Subscribe while you're there. Feck it, you might as well. Hit the thumbs up and the little bell. Any questions about bariatric surgery or the process, let me know. I'm all in. Okay, thanks for watching. Bye. Love you. <laughs>